Guess who's back? Back again. <laughs> Stella's back. Tell a friend. Wait, is that how it goes? Did I legit get that right? <laughs> I'm back. I'm back as a flight attendant. <laughs> Today is my first day back to work in like almost four weeks between traveling and getting super, super sick. And so many of you guys DM'd me and messaged me and commented and wished me well on Instagram and Facebook. And thank you guys so much. I read so many of those messages and I was like coughing and trying to respond back to you guys. <coughs> thank you. Using all like the sick emojis. I love the sick emojis. I think they're so cute. But yeah, so back at work today, been four weeks. Whew, it was a long day. There was, a, there was a lot going on. And I posted on Instagram a picture and I was like, where did I land? Who's gonna guess it? And so many of you guys guessed Miami. A lot of you guys thought I was coming to Miami. So, so close. I'm actually in Tampa. This lovely hotel room behind me is in Tampa. So here I am. I don't know how you would have guessed Tampa. Like the picture was of me in the aircraft. So I haven't really posted a lot because I was super duper sick, but I'm so excited to be back. Today, I'm gonna do an updated what is in this crew bag. So I was sitting on the jump seat and I was like, why is my bag so heavy? Like what is in here? I haven't used it in like four weeks. I thought, you know what? I'm gonna go through everything in here with you guys <laughs> so you guys can see what really is in my flight attendant bag. Like, I don't think it's gonna be that glamorous or pretty. Like there is some random stuff in here. And next week I have a super, super exciting video coming out. It's a collab with another YouTuber. He's a pilot. I fly with pilots all the time, but this was really a fun opportunity to really know what pilots think about flight attendants. I've got trips all next month. I've got tons of trips, so I'm gonna bring you guys with me as much as I can, and we're gonna fly in the summer with Stella. Let's go through this bag, you guys. I, the last time I did one of these what's in my bags, I was at the, I was at the Vegas layover hotel, the Las Vegas layover hotel. So this is an updated one, and I feel like there's a lot more in this. This is heavy. Let's just start with this on top here so I can get this out. <laughs> so this is my shoe bag. This is my shoe bag. I've literally had this bag since my first year as a flight attendant, four and a half, four years. Every year that I've been a flight attendant and everybody always compliments this bag. Okay, so next right here, is my makeup bag. I believe I got this makeup bag last year during Vlogmas at Harrods in London. My favorite, you guys knew I needed a new makeup bag. I had that white one for like ever. <laughs> the thing was, that thing was out of control. All right, next I have this Louis Vuitton like little, um, little like carry-all. And in here actually has my has my neon wallet. So I don't know why I have that. That's basically all that's in here. Oh, a gear tie. You guys, gear ties are uh, amazing. Are you kidding me? Love these things. And then like just some like random cards in here. Next, <laughs> I have an extra scarf. You never know when a girl's gonna need another scarf. So I have an extra scarf. Next, I have my company issued tablet. So this is basically my manual and everything to do with my job. So that was a lot. That was a bulk of stuff, but you guys, there's random stuff in here. Oh, okay, I have my Travel and Glow mask in one of these fun iridescent pouches. <laughs> okay. Oh, I've got like company announcements. I've got a receipt here, guys, for the sandwich that I bought today, the Napa, Chip it, the Napa Chicken Avocado Sandwich that I got at Terminal A and DFW Airport. Okay, we've got some, some cords here. So this, I'm doing really good. I have my gear tie around this cord and no gear tie around this cord. I kinda had a 
little trouble finding these gear ties, but they're on Amazon. And I recommend getting the small ones. They're, these are like the three inch ones, and these are perfect. The three inch size is perfect for um, cords. The six inch size is a little too big for me, but as you can see, I need another one. Oh man, oh man, okay. So then I have, I have an iPhone charger plug, but with no, no cord. I have no idea where the cord is. I have trash and a rubber band. That's like one pocket in here. Okay, let's move on to this other pocket. I'm just gonna like pull it out. <laughs> All right, I have a bag with some tea, two tea bags, two detox teas in there. I've got a McCann's Irish oatmeal. McCann's Irish oatmeal. Just add hot water, guys. I, this is just trash. This is a mini envelope. Don't know where I got that. Another rubber band. A nail file. I don't know why these are in my bag, but I have these like green juice gummy bears. I don't even know. I think my company was giving these out, but they've been sitting in my bag for over a month, so I think they have to go in the trash because I don't think I can eat those. Tied, like wash things, so if I get a stain, or if I need to do like a quick load of laundry at the hotel, I've got these guys here. All right, who can guess how many pens I have in my bag? You guys comment down below to guess how many pens. This is just from one spot in my bag, and here's four. So how many pens do you guys think I have? And I lose pens all the time. People are always asking, do you have a pen? Do you have a pen? I'm like, sure, here's a Hyatt pen. Here is a Crown Plaza. So let's look in here. So pretty much cleaned out that pocket and cleaned out this pocket. I still have this middle pocket here and a few pockets back here. This tote bag, so this bag was company issued. And this bag has so many pockets and hidden little spots to put so many things. I love it. All right, I have my best friend pouch here. And I was out shopping with a friend and we saw these and she has the other half of this. And in here I just have like my glasses cleaner spray and little cloths to keep my glasses nice and neat. Gum, you guys. I always, when I'm flying, I always try to have gum in my bag because a lot of the times you're sitting next to another flight attendant on the jump seat and you guys are like having a conversation and you're literally like this close. How are you doing? <laughs> so essential to have gum when you travel. I have my keys in here. I've had this forever. I love this guy. Hand sanitizer. I think my company gave us those too. Oh, another cord. So this cord I think is for my tablet. Yeah, so this goes with this. But another one that doesn't have the gear tie. And look how messy that is in my bag. I need more gear ties. Another loose tea bag <laughs> hanging around. Ooh, a flashlight. This is a required piece of equipment when you are a flight attendant. Is this on? Can you see it? Yeah. When you are a flight attendant, you need to have a flashlight. So there's mine. Uh, another random tea bag. Okay, a piece of gum wrapper, but no gum but it looks like it would have had a piece of gum in it. Another pen, guys, another pen. Uh, lip gloss, this is Chanel lip gloss and it is in the color 744. It's such a light, like iridescent, sparkly, like peachy pink. It's 
really, really pretty, guys. I just recently got it. I'm loving it. This is a Nail Tech nail file. It's pretty much perfect for travel because it has its little home that it lives in. So it's not gonna scratch everything in your bag. I find that when I take nail files, if I don't keep them covered, they scratch everything in my bag. I had a really unfortunate situation with my iPhone one time. Two more mini rubber bands here. There is so much stuff in here, you guys. <laughs> Let's just look at everything I have so far. And my bag is not even empty. Set you back over there. And let's keep going. All right, so that was the middle pocket. Oh my gosh. All right, this is the back pocket. I have a Chick-fil-A $10 gift card that, I, I don't know. It's not even like connected onto the thing. And you know what? I really can't use the Chick-fil-A gift cards in the airports because a lot of the stores or restaurants or coffee shops in the airport don't take gift cards. Is that not so weird? Okay, more rubber bands, a pair of headphones. Now, these are the headphones that we give out on the plane. I always keep one or two extra pairs in my tote bag because sometimes we're not catered with headphones and I want to, if a passenger says, oh, this is like a five hour flight, I need a pair of headphones, that I can give them to that passenger. So random. So I have, let me know if you guys are gonna be able to see these, a pair of earrings that is just randomly at the bottom of this bag, okay? Just a random pair of earrings that I'm gonna put over there because I've probably been looking for those earrings for like ever. I have a bottle opener. I have no idea where this bottle opener came, but there it is. Oh no. This is like, this is a hot tangled mess, but this necklace my mom got me a really long time ago and the chain, it broke. And so I threw it in my bag to like salvage it but I haven't gotten it fixed. And so it's just been in my bag for a really long time. And another rubber band was attached to it. And then this is, is an iPhone converter to plug headphones in. Oh, I really should get that necklace fixed. I loved that peace sign. She bought it for me, I think when I was like in college. So I just need a new chain. I have three different sizes of rubber bands. You guys know my hair is ferocious and it loves to be up in a business bun. Oh, and then I have these little things, like four of these. And these are to put your hair in a bun. So that is literally everything in all of these pockets. <laughs> like look at all these pockets, it's so out of control. Uh, and then I have one pocket in the back here. Let's see what I have in here. Another pen, a pair of these kid wings. So we give these to kids when they come on the aircraft and it just says flight crew. They can pin it onto their shirt and have a pair of flight wings just like flight attendants or pilots. So these are really cute. Our company brought these back a few years ago or yeah, like a few years ago and they've been really, really popular. Okay, I have another pair of headphones. So in case two passengers need those headphones, I got them. So that's everything in this hidden back pocket. Now we've got these front two pockets and this is where I keep most of my like lip products and stuff that I need, like that I don't have to dig through my bag for, stuff that I kind of need like more right away. So I got my cell phone in the front there. I hadn't even taken that out. My passport, which I always want my passport really close to me because I want it handy. Another piece of like random piece of paper. This is when I was at the Denver airport. I met this service dog, Nigel, and he was so cute and he just spreads joy. Canine Airport Therapy Squad. Nigel was the cutest. Randomly have these stir sticks, so don't know why I have those in my bag, but there they are. Two more pens. 
Two more pens to add to the collection. Who's guessed right? You guys, okay. So, I, so I've got to like get up close for you. So this red lipstick that I'm wearing right now, literally I've only applied it, reapplied it once all day. Amazing. It's Charlotte Tilbury. This color is so Marilyn. And you guys look at that red. It's so amazing. It's not drying, so it's not gonna dry you out. Then I also bought the lip pencil, and this is called Kiss and Tell. So this color is Kiss and Tell, and it's like red. It's a really, really bright red. But this is literally the best lip liner I have ever used. It was amazing, and the guy at Charlotte Tilbury said that it's like waterproof and long-lasting, and it really did last all day. This combination, is really good. So that color is a win in my book, you guys, if you're looking for a fun red. Okay, so I have two more ponytail holders. Guys, I just got this. This is brand new. This is a Pony-O. So I'm just gonna try it for you guys right now. I don't know, I've seen this all over Instagram and I was like, you know what? I want to try one of those pony O's. So it's like you kind of like squish it. I don't even really know how it works. I just got it. So I'm still a little bit of a learning curve. So you pull your hair through and the pony O's black. So it's going to be hard to see. Then you smush it flat like flat like that, and then you curve it back. And it's supposed to give you this like out of control, high volume ponytail. Let me look, oh my gosh, I'm like looking in the viewfinder right now, yeah! I have to like scoot you guys back to get my pony in the picture. Okay, I think this needs to be the thumbnail, like, Still some more stuff in here, you guys. I have a small like baby clip here. I have another lip liner that I haven't even opened. I got it as a sample. I have a mini chapstick here, a little tiny one. I have no idea where I got this little chapstick. It's really cute. I have the most random things in my bag right now. Okay, last. Last pocket right here, you guys. This tiny little pocket. What is in here? Okay, this is mainly lip products, I know. <laughs> Two MAC lip liners here. And these are nude colors, and the two colors I have are Spice and Whirl. I have one of the Revlon matte lipsticks that I told you guys about that I really, really like. But this isn't my favorite. This one's a little bit pink. This is, this is called Kisses. This is not uh, Spice, the one I like. Okay, I have my AirPods and I put stickers all over my AirPods so that I know that they're mine. Two more rubber bands. A girl is not gonna go anywhere without her rubber bands. And then one of my favorite lipsticks ever is this one here and this is Loved Lovecraft by Kat Von D. This is such a beautiful, like pinky, mauvey nude. Obsessed, I love that color. Okay, oh my gosh. I think that's everything. Oh, and some Midol. <laughs> Two tablets of Midol. Oh my gosh, you guys. Empty, but look at all these pockets. All right, who guessed? how many pens I had, let's see. And this isn't even, I feel like this is a low number. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I have eight pens in my bag. I feel like I've had more than eight before. Yeah, guys, look at all of that stuff. So who is here still till the end of the video? Really, who is still here? <laughs> I feel like this was a really 
long video. I have not done a really long video for you guys, I feel like, in kind of a minute. If you guys are still here at the end of this video, I don't know, comment Napa avocado chicken sandwich. <laughs> and then when people go to the comments and read, they're gonna be like, Napa avocado chicken sandwich? <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm like in a silly goofy mood. I'm just really happy to be back at work. I love working with crews and meeting passengers and you guys know I love being a flight attendant. I started this channel because I love being a flight attendant so much. So I'm just happy to be back at work and happy to be back interacting with you guys and making fun videos. So as always, be nice to your flight attendant and I'll see you guys next week for my collab video, which I'm so excited about. <laughs> Bye guys.